I don't often film <coughs> custom cars, but I definitely made an exception on this one. This uh, is a 56 Chevy Bel Air hardtop, styled by George Barris. Now, either he did it himself or it was done in a facility that uh, was under his direction. And uh, there are pictures of this car uh, on a plaque in front of the car, but I didn't want to show that because of possible copyright problems. So you just have to trust me that uh, there's uh, legit legitimacy to this car. Uh, it originally had a, uh, a different grill, but that was changed. It was originally a vertical grill. It happens to be for sale too. So, yeah, this is uh, really wild. Like that uh, look on the wheels, and we've got the, the side pipes, which are very popular at the time, and the nice upholstery. And you see a plaque there, signed by Barris. Tack, extra gauges, and custom wheel. A lot of pinstriping on the car. That was popular too at the time. Now, now we're going to see probably the most uh, eccentric part of the car, and that's the uh, tail lamps kind of a bat wing effect and uh, more graphics there pin striping the paint is uh, according to the owner the original paint there's some cracking I guess it's lacquer so there's uh, been some age related uh, cracking in the paint but uh, you gotta love it for what it is and there's the uh, horizontal grill there and the cannon tail uh, headlamps.